Hello everybody, my name is Sonic. Welcome to a reaction video. In this reaction video, I'm checking out a Pokemon Presents. Yeah, Pokemon Presents. So, Pokemon Presents, well, Pokemon, you know, apparently at, on February, February 26th, they had a presentation on February 26th. But I hadn't seen it at the time when they showed it, so here I am trying to you know, check it out and see it for myself. <laughs> I guess I was late to the whole scene, but whatever. I don't care what I'm seeing or whatever. I'm checking it out and I'm going to react to it here right now. As soon as I'm popping up on, you'll see it on screen right here, right next to me. So, here we go. So, Pokemon Presents Pokemon, I believe it's their 25th anniversary. It just says hashtag Pokemon25 in the top of the video. So, boom. There it is. Yep, oh, this way, not, not over here. <laughs> this way, yeah, from your perspective. Uh huh, yeah, right here. So, here we go. Let's begin. So, I'm gonna react to this and see it, and then I guess I'll see my thoughts about it afterwards. If I can remember anything enough about what I'd say about it. So, yeah, all right, <laughs> let's go. Oh, all right, let's go. Let's begin. I move my adjust my microphone. All right, so let's start. Let's start this up. Pokemon Presents. Hope I'm inside view of the camera okay and not cut off screen or anything. Alright, let's go. Let's begin. Let's see this. Pokemon Presents Pokemon 25. Boom. Pokemon, the Pokemon Company. There it is. Pokemon. 25 years of non-stop adventure, it says. Ha! Pokeball. Ooh, look at all those Pokemon games. 1996? Red and green. Cable? Yeah, I remember the link cable trading. Some cards, yep. Anime. <laughs> yeah, they had an anime. Yeah. Blue, movies? Blue and yellow? Transfer pack? Through the battle? Huh? Mike? Stop! Ah, uh, I remember one of those things. Rumble pack, on the Google color, wow. What the heck? Nostalgia. Snap, I'm getting nostalgia from seeing all this stuff, right? I'm talking about Snap and Jet. 1998. The gold and silver version, yeah. They're showing like every thing here. It's an anime, train card, mobile adapter. Really? Teletrade? Huh. New device. Okay. What? What the heck? Okay. The 2002. They're just showing the whole history here of every game. God, all the cable connections. My God. So much. I've seen so much of the same stuff here, but newer variations of it. Oh. Oh, yeah, I'm seeing the history, of course, the history of the evolving children, dungeon, e-reader. Oh, the TV show again. Oh, what the heck? Swing motion? My god. I remember Diamond Pearl. God, I remember every one of these games. I've, I've had almost every one of these games. Like global trade. Not, yep, anime, of course, yeah, global trading, the vault of the trading. Blue the line. Transferring. Walk together, huh? Two are going to sit. Dang. It's a history here, trail battle. Yeah, this game. I didn't play with my chapter Pokemon Diamond, to be honest. Oh, train cards still. And of course, anyway. Movies again. See, so you're seeing the. Black and white, blue and white, yeah, right. Huh. Uh, oh, online card battle thing, too. Man. I don't know what to say. It's still a bit of the same, but a little different as an overtime. Hmm. Can't say I remember that. Then again, we'll have to go back. And yeah, X and Y. Right. That's a lot of the new stuff in here. Anyway, yeah. 
Oh my god. Oh. Matt Arubus. Right? Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire are uh, Pokemon Tournament, right? Jeez. It says on the bottom there what it is. I love her. Ah, uh, that's when Pokemon Go comes out. God, this entire history here. Come on, 16. Yeah. Sun and Moon now. Of course. Yeah, right. Ultra Moon. Oh, let's go. What the frick? You went by too fast there. How do you? What the heck? Trainers. Ah. Funny. Huh? Ah. Uh, I remember that movie. God, Jesus, entire history here. And Sword and Shield. Current right now. Yep. Yeah. Oh, God, the changes over time here. Yeah, right. That's, I've not really seen the anime to that yet, to be honest. No, I haven't. Golly. What? I don't think I ever saw that. God, the entire history. Oh my god. Just from the beginning? Ah, Smash Bros. It wasn't Smash Bros. Yeah. Onyx, good. Got all this stuff. Man, I tell you, that's a lot. Jeez. My god. Yeah. Wow. Just wow. Man. All possibilities. In your hands. Please, Nintendo. I mean, Pokemon Company 25. Wow. Really? Oh, there's still Hello, more, of course. I'm Can't be it. From the Pokemon Company. Hello! February 27th is the hmm. date Pokemon Red and Pokemon Green were released in Japan. Marking mm -hmm. the beginning of the Pokemon series. Oh, today? An astounding 25 oh. years have passed since wow. the Pokemon yeah. series was born. We shared so much with you yeah. over the past 25 <laughs> years through do our that. games, but also through so many other mediums, thanks to the support you've all shown us. Mm -hmm. Thank you, each and every one of you. Today, mm, you're Mr. Utsunomiya will introduce our latest updates. Okay. What you got there? Hello there. My name is Utsunomiya from the Pokemon Company. Hello. First, I'd like to give you the latest update on the new Pokemon Snap game. We've All right. put together a video that will show you some of the gameplay. Please mm -hmm. have a look. Sure. Let's see it. Was he? I can't remember what he said just now, but I'm about to see it anyway. All right, hold on, Snap. New one. After the original, Lender. Welcome to the, the whole history of there. Pokemon Snap. This mm -hmm. is the Lentil region. You'll All ride right. the Neo One Ooh. through the jungle, across the desert, you know, and what the even fuck under the sea <laughs> to research Pokemon in their natural habitats. Mm -hmm. Yep, and just like the original you one. Won't be alone. Sure. Professor Mirror, who's doing research in the Lentil region, and research team members Rita and mm -hmm. Phil are there to support you, yeah. so you're in good hands. Uh huh. Now right. Was that just rival? All right. By watching wild Pokemon, Research. you can discover behaviors and expressions ah. that are rarely seen. <laughs> Look, Funny. the surfing Alolan Raichu. Oh my god. <laughs> and Funny. there's Vaporeon. Let's try throwing it a fluff fruit. That's it. Now's our chance. Take a picture of that after doing that, really? Oh my oh, gosh. It's Tyranitar. <laughs> what a wild sure. way to eat. Sure. Feed them and then just take a picture. Okay. Here's nah. a park at night. Yeah, who played the original then? The yeah, night. right. Oh, that sure the... made Hoot Hoot happy. Okay. Right. You nah. also have Illumina orbs, something the professor invented. If hmm. you use one of these, you can make any oh. Pokemon glow. Okay. Huh. Part of the goo. Hey. Oh, those flames changed color. Huh. 
That's the one, yeah. Starter. Good use of your tools to take Z shots that Lunasaur. really stand out. Then, yeah. show the photos you took to the professor. Ooh, I got never actually Four played stars. the first Pokemon. It's not me. Moment there. Not really. Catch a variety of Star different Wars. behaviors on camera to fill up your Pokemon photo decks. Rates how good the picture is, I guess. You'll be able to edit the photos you've taken. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, right. Get more. Use features like there. stickers and frames to make your favorite photos even more special. Hmm. And I'm sure That's you'll nice. want to show off your best photos, right? Okay. We know that feeling well. When you hmm. want to do that, it's time to go online. You like can share pictures. your favorite photos and check out photos from ah, around the world. Look at and that. if your photo becomes popular, ah, it might funny. even be featured and get more attention. Mm -hmm. Seeing something like that may inspire you to go back and take even more photos. <laughs> We're getting closer ah, to the start that, of your adventure. Look. Unexplored islands and plenty of Pokemon uh, are waiting in the what the? region. So make sure you're prepared. <laughs> ah. Oh my Whoa. god. Is that the mythical Pokemon Celebi? Really? Get it quick, hurry. The lentil region is waiting huh. for you. You miss it, you never get a chance to get it. It's legendary, get it? April 30th, 2021. Wait, did that say available now? What did you think? I can't remember. I hope you're looking forward to the game's release. Oh, pre orders now. That's a... cool, right? Next, I'd like to tell you about several nice. events we're holding to celebrate Pokemon Day. In the Pokemon uh, Sword and Pokemon yeah, Shield games, Pokemon special Max Raid battles featuring Gigantamax mm -hmm. Pikachu are underway. Oh, yeah, I remember hearing about and that. Pokemon Cafe Mix, we're holding a promotion in which you can receive 2,500 golden acorns for logging mm -hmm. Yeah, they did that Pokemon already. Go, Articuna, Seriously, Zephyr, I wish I had saw this Pokemon sooner. I'm not kidding. The time I've seen this. As part of a Kanto themed celebration mm, in I actually did that on that time. Pokemon Masters EX, Galar Region Champion Leon, and his partner Pokemon Charizard mm -hmm. will arrive at last. Huh. We hope yeah, I didn't get a chance to see this. this in time when I wanted to. Next, I'd like to present the latest news about the Pokemon video game series. Have a look at this video. Like, literally, wasn't able to see this when they first showed it. I had so much stuff coming on and. Oh, let's just see what they're gonna do here. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is already passed, of course, as we've seen this. Got all those new. Oh no, are you. You got another Pokemon game? Now I have to go. You just had Pokemon Sword and Shield already. What now? What's this? Oh, is this the next generation again? You already had Sword and Shield already. You already done with Sword and Shield and moving on now? What? What are you doing with Diamond and Pearl? What's this? I remember playing the world. That's probably like the last Pokemon game I actually really played much of. All these other ones, newer ones, I didn't play much after it. Oh, now they bring it in 3D now. Pokemon Diamond is Diamond of Pearl is now like 3D. Wow, they're bringing it back. Gotta remember this generation. I think I used Chimchar last time I played Diamond. Yeah, I did. But, ah, oh, there's a rival again. Man. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I forgot her name. Dawn, right? Yeah, Dawn. Of course, I remember that generation. I played that generation. After that, I didn't play much. As much as I used to. Not kidding. New fall, new fall form. God. Jeez, look at those. The animation for the battles. Brilliant diamond. Shining pearl. Reboots of those original games. Hmm. Okay. I kind of feel unsure whether or not I'd buy a reboot, even though they remastered it. You no, know, another story with I could, but that, then again, that was the last Pokemon game I really actually played. Pokemon series enters a new era. Another new era. So you're this done with Sword and Shield long, already? Long time yeah. Ago. When the Sinnoh region was still only a vast wilderness. I never able to find much of Pokemon as much as I like to. And goings of people. As much as I used to. While in the mountains and seas, Pokemon roamed as they pleased. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Really. Of course. Pokemon. Though the mountains. 
And some person sitting there. Look at those. Wow. Look at this. And we already see stuff like this in Pokemon Sword and Shield. What I'm saying. Just more upgraded graphics or something like that. Hey. That almost looks like a dime from Pearl and Diamond. Wait, hold on. What? Okay. That's a bit new. Don't remember ever doing that in past Pokemon. And Sword and Shield. What is this? What the heck are they doing? Is this an MMO? Seriously, I thought Sword and Shield was like an MMO. But this, this is just... Dude, what is this? Ah! What? Dang. Okay. Like, you know, it's just... They, every generation just feels like... Dude, what? Those three. Oh, it's that generation. Wait, hold on. Is that just a mix of Star Pokemon from three multiple generations? Look at that Pokemon looked a bit unusual there. That looked like an MMO. I'm not sure if it's even like a new generation or not, but it said new era. Ah, this legendary Pokemon again. Oh, snap. Pokemon Legends. Arceus. Okay. Losing Worldwide in early 2022. Legends Arceus. I'm pleased to announce two new additions to the Pokemon video game series, both taking place in the Sinnoh region. Oh? First, I'd like to present the Pokemon oh. Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games. Mm -hmm. These are faithful remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version games, mm -hmm. which were released for the Nintendo DS system in Japan 15 yeah. years ago. Now it's on the Switch, right? Ah, the 3DS, 3DS is discontinued. Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games. Remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version now and the Pokemon Switch. Pearl version games, which were released have the for 3DS the Nintendo anymore. DS system, are coming to Nintendo Switch. Yeah. Flips These now. games will be developed by Ilka Inc., who also worked on Pokemon Home. The project is being directed by Yuichi Ueda of Ilka, mm. as well as Game Freak's Junichi Masuda, who was the director for the original Pokemon Diamond version mm. and Pokemon Pearl version games. Mm -hmm. Your adventure will take place All in right. the Sinnoh region. Rich in nature and with mm. towering Mount Coronet at its heart, it is a land of myths that. passed down through the ages. The yeah. sense of scale of the original game's towns and roots has been carefully preserved. I don't remember all these locations. Through familiar locations now in 3D. You'll set out on your journey after choosing either Turtwig, Chimchar, or Piplup. I do it again. I'm like, to, I'm like going with Chimchar again. Games, <laughs> you can enjoy a grand adventure together with all the Pokemon from Pokemon Diamond no, version before. and Pokemon Pearl version. Right. Newcomers and previous visitors to the Sinnoh region mm -hmm. alike can look forward to experiencing the original Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl stories, freshly recreated for Nintendo mm -hmm. Switch. Mm -hmm. Right. Cause I remember playing this game. Yeah. Isn't that the first what game with the think? global truth? Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining it's nice. Will launch simultaneously around the world late this year. Mm. We hope you're all excited for a nostalgic yet fresh adventure in the Sinnoh region. Mm. I guess. Next, I don't know. Allow me to introduce Maybe. you to the Pokemon Legends Let's Arceus be honest. Game. Okay. Pokemon Legends Let's Arceus that. represents a new approach for the Pokemon video game series. Development is in full swing at Game Freak, with the aim to deliver mm. a gaming experience that breaks new ground for the Pokemon series. Mm. Looks like it too. Please have a look at this video. Yeah, you showed us like full 3D, like you actually just what we saw there. You know, I can't even explain it, but the events yeah. of this game unfold in the Sinnoh of old. In this time too, Mount Coronet towers over the center of the region. Pokemon live freely in the wild here, but the harsh environments may be different from the Sinnoh region mm. you remember. Okay. In this era, people right. have journeyed to Sinnoh from all over and founded a prosperous village in the hope of learning mm. more about this land. Mm. As for these three Pokemon, Rowlet, Cyndaquil, and Oshawott, it seems they were brought to Sinnoh by a certain professor who encountered them while traveling around various regions. Mm. 
You'll set off on your adventure after receiving a first partner Pokemon of your own from this Because I don't remember those three being together. And those look like they're all three from three different generations. The as your base, they're you'll just venture the same. Out to the like, I just don't remember the region On your quest to create Sinnoh's very first Pokedex. Hmm. Very first. Even in this era, wild what? Pokemon can be caught with Pokeballs. Right. You can also engage in Pokemon battles alongside your now. Pokemon allies. Jeez, it almost looks real. Sharpen your skills for both catching and battling Pokemon and yeah, strive to some... complete your Pokedex. Still like an RPG. Yeah, not like Pokemon. Now po for the mythical Pokemon uh, that graces the game's title and story. Uh, I forgot. Arceus. According to legend, Arceus shaped all there is in this world. But how is this Pokemon connected to your journey? Mm. Okay. The answer to this question and more awaits you in this exciting new mm. action RPG adventure for the Nintendo Switch system. Mm-hmm. Right. Okay. Uh, look at that. Battle animation. Battle animations. Yeah, updated. Yeah, I can't. Pokemon Legends I'm, Arceus I'm gonna try to say. around the world early next year. Next year. We hope you're all cool. excited to set out on these adventures right. across the Sinnoh region, each one distinctly different from the other, with the wonderfully nostalgic Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl, as well <laughs> as the Pokemon video game series New Journey, Pokemon mm -hmm. Legends Arceus. Oh. Yeah. Next year. As Pokemon celebrates 25 years, we will continue to challenge ourselves and deliver new ways for everyone to enjoy Pokemon even more. Thank you very much for watching. You're welcome. No problem. Thank you for sharing. Okay, so... Yeah. I can't believe I always do like... Why is it I always do like I'm lost for words? Literally. I mean, we just saw everything there, what they did. They showed the whole history of them. Like, God, all those games. It's just... I played almost every one of those Pokemon games that they showed their whole history. I remember, I remember the whole link cables and stuff like that, and how you evolved, and you started less and less using link cables as the each generation went through. You had different like variations of the link cables and such, you know. And then it got to a point where you didn't need the link cables anymore to try and trade or battle. Nah, you can do it all online now. <laughs> Yeah, I remember that, the link cables with the Game Boy and the Game Boy Dance. Man, all that stuff just brings back memories the more I think about it or look back at it. So, that was, mm-hmm, that was Pokemon Swift at the anniversary. Man, so Arceus Legends and, yeah, so they remastered Pearl and Diamond. Just like they remastered, you know, Omega, like, was it Omega Ruby or Alpha Sapphire or something? I feel like I'm getting it backwards, but you know what I'm talking about. It was a leaf green and fire red or something like that. Remember the remix? Yeah. That's what they did there. So now they got remasters of those now. Like, that was literally the last Pokemon duration I really played very much of. It, well, to be honest, any... Any Pokemon generation after Diamond and Pearl, I didn't play very much of. Like, yeah, I still get to play much of Sword and Shield. I'm not kidding. I wasn't able to play much of Sword and Shield. And it looks like this Pokemon Ar Legends Arceus. I kind of feel like I have trouble remembering names and stuff. I do that a lot. Yeah. Because I feel like the three Pokemon, three starter Pokemon in the RC Legends don't go together, you know? Were they from three different generations paired together in this new generation or something? That's what it looks like. I'm like, okay. Yeah, the Pokemon Legends RCS. Yeah. You know, like, because it feels like when you look at every game, you're seeing a bit of the same thing over and over again but more like newer and still old you know 
it's like oh it's the same thing over and over again but newer than it was before it was like more evolved it just feels like the entire history of pokemon is just evolving over time like it's the same thing every generation it feels like it's still the same thing every generation but more evolved you know that's a that's what i was noticing there from everything it shows like just, just wow all that stuff we kept seeing there you know it's just a lot that is a lot i remember going through playing of course i played the original i played gold and silver i didn't play sadly i didn't play the generation after pokemon gold and silver i believe i did play pokemon diamond and pearl and that was the last pokemon generation that, that i really like just played a whole lot of because after that i don't know i just didn't play a very much of pokemon black and white or x and y hold on okay never mind i can't believe i can't say i remember seeing sun and moon in there they did say they did show sun and moon in there i didn't see the anime for pokemon uh sword and shield yeah no i of course there's an anime they, they had like an anime for every generation you ever notice that yeah it's like just a bit of the same but more involved that's what they did there that's what i remember most of in this whole video yeah new pokemon snap and they had this little presentation that pokemon pokemon company did i almost keep saying nintendo i mean it's associated with nintendo but they kind of separate themselves on their own channel their official pokemon channel like it's separate from nintendo you when know, it's still associated with nintendo in some way but yeah you know mm -hmm, I'll, I'll have to think about it i don't know if i'll revive pokemon the diamond and pearl remastered i already forgot the titles you know it's still diamond and pearl but more remastered it's like yeah i still have to play a bit more of pokemon sword sword and shield like i have sword but not shield i never got shield i just got sword pretty much so yeah the pokemon legends of Darcyus. I kind of like how they need like your character your avatar that your trainer you're playing as in the game is more third person like oh you can throw your pokeball in third person now you can actually hide in the bush hide and don't try not to get spotted by your pokemon and just try and throw a pokeball at it instead of actually trying to catch the pokeball like throw the pokeball while you're already like in battle with it it's, that's what I was noticing there. That's a little different from what you used to have to do in previous Pokemon games. But yeah, I feel like, what was the last, cause like, God, seriously, I feel like what was the last time I even really actually played a Pokemon game? I'm not kidding. Like, I still have never actually played Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Nope, never played a single one of those. I mostly played each of the newer generations, but like I said, after Pokemon Diamonds, I own Pearl and I just didn't play as much of them as I, as I used to, but I still still kind of got them and tried to play them, you know? Like, I didn't feel, I feel like I didn't play much of Pokemon White and Black. I wanted to, you know, X and Y, that too, or Sun and Moon. I didn't play much of those three generations too, and I really wanted to, and it's Pokemon Sword and Shield, but yeah, I know. I don't know why, it just seemed like it just, I kind of just, didn't play them as much as I used to, but part of me still likes trying to at least play them. These generations of Pokemon. So, yeah. So, alright. That was me reacting to Pokemon's. That, that is Pokemon's 25th anniversary, is it not? I think Pokemon 25. I feel like that's their 25th anniversary, you know? Yeah, I'm not kidding. It feels like that's their Pokemon. That's their 25th anniversary, is it not? That happened on February 26th. I know, I know, at the time of me seeing this, it's not even February anymore. I'm like, God, I wish I saw this sooner when it actually happened, but like I said before, I wasn't able to see it in time until like a later time. It's just, but no, I just wanted to react to it and see it anyway, since I didn't see it earlier when they really showed it, you know? I didn't see it live or anything when I want to. I was at work. Yeah, February 26th is a Friday. 
so yeah so, so yeah still cool though yeah and then after that they start going pokemon go after every generation they just did pokemon go now you can do it in, in real life through through uh, through what is it augmented reality with the phone uh, pokemon go yeah i played a little bit of pokemon go but not a whole lot so yeah, Pokemon Go is like, oh, taking all of what you experience in the games in the real life, basically. Yeah, it's just... Like, really. I always feel like I'm lost for words after these... After doing some reaction videos. I, I don't know, I just still like checking out the games they show and such. Even if I feel like I may never actually get a chance to play them. Feels like that with a lot of games I see. But, Still fun to check check out some of my do and also because of my niche. I don't know how many times I gotta say this throughout my videos, you know. I'm there's a lot of games I want to play or get around to play, but I think the hard niche niche. I keep saying niche. Is it niche? It is niche, right? Not niche. Niche niche niche. It looks like it's spelt it's spelt niche, but it's pronounced niche. But I don't know. Whatever. With how you pronounce it. Yeah, so cool. I gotta get back into playing a bit more of Sword and Shield. Seriously, before the rematch. I, I don't know if I will replay Diamond and Pearl remastered. I don't know, maybe. It's a maybe, you know? Because the thing about remastered, it's, it's just. Like, I've already played it. Do I really want to buy it again? Just, I don't know. Maybe. We'll see. We'll never know. But the Pokemon Legend Arceus, it's like, God, that's just a little bit of what, they, of what we've seen there. I guess we'll have to wait until they show a bit more of that. Aside from actually catching Pokemon in third person now. That actually running into a Pokemon and it, like, changes and it's like, oh. It feels like it doesn't, like, you know... With, I can't exactly explain with how they used to do it, but if you played Pokemon in the past, you know how they used to do it. You used to not have to, like, you couldn't, like, see yourself throw the Pokemon. Like, excuse me, you couldn't, like, literally see yourself throw the Pokeball in third person. You couldn't do that before. Or it's like you had to go through the grass, and going through the grass is the only time you actually... I, you never see which Pokemon you run into when you walk into the grass. Now, you actually get to see the Pokemon before you even run. Now you're like, you actually see yourself hide in the grass and try and catch it. It's so different from before. Yeah, like how it's it's still a bit of the same as what we've seen. It's it's always the same. It's the same stuff we see every, every year, every generation. But a little newer. That's what they've, they've done. Like how you start out with link cables to be able to train and battle. And how they evolved from link cables over time to newer versions of having some kind of link cable thingy. No longer, no longer restricted with the wire. Now it's wireless and now it's like online. But things like that. Like, I'm not kidding. I didn't play just like really. I wanted to play more Pokemon after Pokemon Diamond Pro, but I just didn't play them as much of it as I used to. You know, part of me still always wanted to. But yeah, I know. It's just Yeah, one of those things. You play so many games or you're doing something else in weaker time. It's like yeah. I don't know. You know? Really. I I hope I'm not repeating myself again, but yeah. Just talking a bit about everything we saw there. It's cool though, it was nice. We like yeah, of course I still like Pokemon. I've always liked Pokemon since the first generation. Just really, I don't I don't seem to play as much as I used to. Plus, I have a niche here, niche on my YouTube channel where I check out in game events. I barely have time to just do a playthrough of playing a game instead of checking out these time sensitive seasonal events of what I'm doing on my channel. But since I kind of evolved with how I execute that content, I feel like. Well, since it's a newer year from previous year, we, year of me trying to create the content, I mean, I should at least have more time to be able to 
or most content that I want to try to do. Like, I want to do a bit more than just so much with seasonal events. That's why I've been changing it up. But, anyways, yeah, so that was me reacting to the Pokemon Presents. If that's not their 25th anniversary, Pokemon 25. Yeah, 25 years of Pokemon. And that's. It's like February 26th is when they had Pokemon Red and red and, and green or it's not red and blue and yellow yeah that's, that's cool so all right yeah that's it for this reaction video so all right guys <laughs> let me know what you guys thought about me reacting to this video or you know what you think about this video of me doing the reaction there Pokemon presents. I honestly wish I saw this sooner, like earlier, like everybody else. But and it wasn't able to. I, I still want to react to this anyway, despite me being late to just react to this. But I don't really care, so I still want to see it anyway. I still want, still want to do a reaction for video for it. Still went for it after we going through some things earlier and such. But yeah, so I did that. Let me know what you guys thought about this in the comments down below. If you want, yeah. Or if you like this video, yeah. I go with a laugh and I like fun. Like, oh, 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 I like what it's so naughty, it's just, oh, that naughty like one, oh, it's just not that like one, I know, it's just, just not that, it's not that, oh, oh, it's not that like one, oh, it's so naughty, oh, it goes in a while. Just hit the like one, if you like to do it. <laughs> If you like the video, it's all up to you, really, you know, yeah, yeah, right? Or if you like to see more from me, or any of my other videos, you know, yeah. You can see more of what I've done here, reaction videos, I don't do reacting videos off the side. I do try to do other things besides seasonal events. I have a niche, we're going to check out seasonal events, like, you know, Christmas, Halloween, or any, uh, like, summer spring you know seasonal events in game events and the events <laughs> i like to go do an overview a summary of the events and then i'll try and go in game in depth to check out more further detail of everything we check out in summary about what's new with the event new skins new timeline timeline and game modes it's fun to do that that's what i do and i kind of very much do all that live because they're time sensitive you know that's what i do on my channel other than these reaction videos and sometimes do like a playthrough and things like that but i feel like halloween's like the best ones out of all like month of horror i do nothing but horror games so yeah if you'd like to see me do a bit of that and more of me doing reaction videos then you could subscribe yeah it's all up to you really it's all up to you if you want to subscribe so so yeah so yeah so, yeah and with that said Thanks for watching, everybody. See you next time. Bye! Woo! <laughs> oh, yeah!